The stars of tomorrow get their shot in the limelight today as the show's coverage of the Southern League is on the air. Tonight, it's postseason action between the Rocket City Trash Pandas and the Pensacola Blue Wahoos. Stepping in, Brendan Lund. And we are set for baseball here this evening. A 1-1. Takes a pass and misses. That's strike two. Good night for baseball all in all. Game time temperature, 63 degrees. Pulled toward right center field. Right fielder is on the run. He makes the catch. A great effort to get there and record the first out of the right. inning. The right fielder. Digging in, Brendan Sanger, right. as he'll get his first Thank opportunity you. in this one. The 1-1 one, one home. Misses, ball two. Two-1. A little too tall that time. Three and one now. Hitters count all the way. Here it comes. And he lays off here. Ball four. And he'll become the game's first base runner here with one away. Stepping up now. Albert Rodriguez. First shot for him here with a runner at first now and one away. Can't keep the weight back. And he falls behind one and two. Try to come in with the fastball, but it's too far in, and it's even at two and two. And here's a ball hit in the air. Here comes the right fielder, but this will land untouched. A swing and a miss. He offered it a ball way outside the strike zone for out number two. So striding forward now, Chris Rogers. He'll get to take his first cuts here. A one and one count. Here's the pitch. Hit out towards second. Oh, and he can't come up with it. At the plate now, Jose Rojas. And he squares up on this one. Deep to straightaway right. And this ball is gone. No chance to make a play on that one. Yeah, he's looked pretty shaky from the first pitch, and things just kind of spiraled out of control from there. I think these guys smell blood in the water, and they punctuated with a three-run job and an early lead. At the plate, Zane Gerwitz. And he fouls this one off. The one-two. Takes this the other way to right. That gets down, and the inning continues. Into the box now, Roberto Baldacchini. Line towards center field. In there, a base hit. Oh, and he botches it. Into the box, Jordan Zimmerman. And he lays off the pitch down and away. Ball two. To me, it looks like he just doesn't trust himself out there on the mound. It's like he's fighting his body on every pitch, and as a result, we're seeing a lot of balls from him early on in this game. He set the 3-1. And he misses with it for ball four. So the bases will be loaded now with two away. Stepping in, Julian Leone. Another first inning RBI opportunity for him here. 1-1 one, one pitches a curve ball that misses ball two. It often becomes harder to hit the zone when the pressure starts to heat up. On a good pitch there. Had him stretching to get out there. And it's two and two now. Hey, I love the aggressiveness right here and wanting to be a hero. But this is where you got to tell yourself to relax a little bit. And the throw is in time to get him to retire the side. Into the box now, Todd McCain. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. 
Now the one and one pitch. Lifted out towards straightaway center field. Lund is there and he has it for the first down. Ready now, Joe Cronin. The second baseman, Joe Cronin. Changes up on him, but that's in the dirt for a ball. One out, nobody on. Into the corner and slicing foul. And the slider gets him swinging, two gone. So stepping in, Back Alexi first. Castillo. The designated hitter, Alexi Castillo. 1-1. Count is 1-2 and two now. Bases are empty here with two men out. Grounded back up the middle. Scooped up. Throw in the dirt, but a good scoop at first saves an error as this side is retired. Riding in once again, Brendan Lund. He flew out in his last at bat. One of the keys to securing a win, they want to keep the pressure on and try to build that lead as much as they can moving into the later oh. innings. And the pitch misses low and away for ball two. All even now, two and two. Here's the pitch. Still even at two and two. Don't be shocked if this pitcher tries to go a little bit further outside the zone. Three foul balls in a row. He wants to get a swing and a miss on this next pitch. Sent on the ground out to second. Throw to first will be in time, and there's one gone here to start the second. In now, Brendan Sanger. He worked a walk and came around to score in his first trip in this game. This is flared out towards second, and this is taken for the out. Digging in, Albert, Albert Rodriguez, Albert. who looked to bounce back Albert. after striking out Rodriguez. his last time up. Yeah, and kind of shocked he got blown away with a fastball. You could tell he was late on that one, and we'll see if he tries to cheat to something this A.B. Cabbage is there, and he'll put it away to retire the side. Bottom of the inning now. And coming forward now is the shortstop, Drew Maggi. Hey, we're still in the early stages in this one. They're only down by a couple of runs. But it's really key for this leadoff guy to try to get on and get a big inning started. A ball and two strikes now. The one-two is laid off for ball two. And he lays off, so it's full now, three and two. Payoff pitch home. Little chopper back to the mound. And there's one away. Now batting, Trey Cabbage. And there's ball two now. Bases are empty, one man out. He's fallen behind now, three and one. Inner third let go. It's a called strike. And he lost him here on 3-2 as that pitch misses. It's ball four. Now at the plate, Jose Miranda. Cabbage stands at first with one out. And this one's up around the eyes. Two and one. High that time with the slider taken for a ball. Good job to work the count and put himself back in the driver's seat. Started off with one strike and now he's got the count in his favor three and one. This is foul right side. And he missed. 
misses again here. It's ball four. And that's back to back walks here with one away. So coming to the plate, Ben Rortbeck. The 2 2. Freezes him. A strikeout looking. Now in the box, a kill the dude. The center fielder. A kill. The dude. The 1 2. Still a ball and two strikes. Already 24 pitches to this point in the inning. High in the air out to center field. And the two out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over. for the third set to get underway and next to bat will be the first baseman Chris Rogers a swing and a shot hit down the corner gone to lead off the inning to the plate now Jose Rojas and whoa, awfully close, but it's ball four according to Woody Keller. The batter number nine. Digging in now, Zane Gerwitz. A runner at first with no outs here. Liner in there for a base hit. Now back. The fifth up. Roberto. So now to the plate, Roberto Baldacchini. Now one hit foul over to the right side as the count moves to one and two. Lifted into the air out towards center field. Center fielder on the run. He gets there to put it away, but the runner tags and breaks for third. And he'll move up to third now. Runners at the corners here with one away. Striding forward now is the Jordan. DH, Jordan Zimmerman, and their runners at the corners now. Now the one and one pitch. With two strikes now and a runner at first, do you go for the strikeout or you're still looking for the double play ball? Good time to try to put the ball down in the strike zone. You can either get a strikeout or a potential double play ball. Count even at two and two. As a look, now the pitch. And a full count as that misses. It's three and two now. For the guy in the mound, this is one of those innings where nothing comes easy. He's thrown a bunch of pitches, and this A.B. hasn't been any different. Definitely laboring at the moment. And he misses with it. Ball four, so that'll load the bases, and now he's really going to need to get a ground ball. 1-1. One, one. When he's pitching effectively, usually that two-seam fastball is moving quite a bit, but here it's just kind of flat and straight. Could be a big part of the reason why he's getting knocked around. Fouled off. Another 2-2 offering. Again, he sends it out of play. Coming up now on 30 pitches in the inning. Fastball misses in the dirt as he tried to get him to chase the low one. Well, I think that pitch is the result of a lot of foul balls. He might have tried to do a little bit too much with it, trying to get him to swing through it, but it just ended up taking off on him. One run is scored. And the runner from second is in to score. It's a 6-0 ball game. Adam Bray is going to come on to pitch here, and in just now the third inning, you have to think he'll be asked to eat Bray. some innings. Whoa. Standing in now, Brendan Lund. And he got him to chase after a bad one there, two and two. He stays alive, still two and two. Three runs already home here. Ground ball right side. 
And that's through into right field for a base hit. The throw home. And he will beat the throw home. It's a 7 nothing contest. The right fielder, number four, Brendan. Stepping in now, Bang. Brendan Sanger. Right back to the mound. Could be an easy two. Relay to first in time. And just like that, this side is retired. Coming to the plate now, Mark Contreras. Lots of baseball left in this one as we're still early on, but you don't want to fall too far behind. They're already down by a bundle, and one of the things you want your leadoff guy to get on and set the table for the big boys to start driving in some runs. And he will pull into second with a leadoff double. At the plate, Todd McKean lifted down the line in left. Left fielder giving chase. He gets there to make the play for the first out of the inning. And the runner, not tagging, will retreat to second base. The batter, number seven. Digging in to try it again. Joe Cronin looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at bat. Sometimes you just got to tip your cap to the guy on the mound. He's getting paid to try and get you out as well. Anytime it gets up there, North to seven, eight pitch ABs. Sometimes it just comes down to pure execution. Let's see if he makes the adjustment right here. A one one. This is line to left. Well, this is right to him in left as he hardly has to move as he handles it for the final out. New inning set to get underway, and that'll give way to the third baseman, Albert Rodriguez. Even though they're up by a boatload early on in this one, you can't get complacent and get lazy. They got to keep the gas pedal down because this team that they're playing can strike and score a lot of runs, too. Line drive to left. And he will run this one down, moving to his right, and that's the first out of the inning. Trying to pick things up where we left off. Chris Rogers is off to a fast start in this one. Two for two, including a home run. And that last at bat when he went deep, he turned around a pretty good fastball. So I'm kind of thinking this guy's a good fastball hitter. So I might want to move that ball up and down and in and out and try not to throw it right down the middle of the plate. Well, I'll even a two and two. Fastball strike three called as he couldn't pull the trigger and there are two away. Now back into the box, okay. Jose Rojas. He launched Rojas. one over the wall back in the opening frame. Line drive and that's a base hit in the center field. Some success with two away and the top of the fourth is still alive. The batter number 19, second base. At the plate now, Zane Gerwitz lifted in the air out towards left center. Long run for the center fielder. He's there to make the play, and that'll retire the side. Ready to go for the last half of the inning, and stepping up as the shortstop, Drew Maggi. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. No. Two ball, one strike. Hit hard to the right side, but foul. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and that's the first out. Settling in now, Trey Cabbage. He drew a walk his first time up. Cabbage. Now a big fastball, and he's well behind it with the swing. Trying to nibble here, and he misses to run it full now. Three and two. Now the payoff pitch home. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. And that nearly would have gotten him on the board. Instead, it's a long foul ball. And a leaping effort, but it's off his glove. Oh, and it eats him up a bit. Third 
to the plate now. Jose Miranda pulls this one in the air out to left. Long run for the left fielder. And this will get all the way to the wall now. And they'll have runners at second and third following the one out double. So now to the plate, Ben Mortbeck. Hot shot to third. And that's the second out. At the plate, Akil Badu comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Runners at second and third with two gone. There's a swing and a missile sent out to center field. Just missed a home run to the deepest part of the yard. It's off the wall. Standing in now, Mark Contreras. Ball two. And this one's in the dirt. Throw goes over to third. And it's too late as he's in there. He's ready. Now the payoff pitch. And a slider called strike three as he couldn't pull the trigger. And the side is retired. Digging in once again, Roberto Baldacchini. His line includes a single and a fly ball and two at-bats thus far. This one's down to third. Fielded cleanly. And the fifth inning will start with a ground out, one away. At the plate, Jordan Zimmerman. No official at-bat for him, but he has scored a run in this one. Got him swinging. Chased it well out of the zone, and there are two gone. Now back. Now at the play, Julian Leon. He's working on a one-for-two game so far. And here's a ball hit in the air. But no chance to run it down. It's a foul ball. Payoff pitch one more time. And this is pop foul, but perhaps playable behind first. And that's going to land foul. Oh dear, that caught him full bore on the mound as it ricochets back toward the plate. Safe after the recovery throw. Good effort, but now we have to wonder whether or not he's going to be okay. Into the box, Brendan Lund. Oh, good action on the two-seamer there, and it's one and two. So two balls and two strikes now. A runner on first with two away. And he pops him up, drifting toward the left side of the infield. Bray will put this one away, and the side is retired. Striding into the box, Todd McCain. He comes in 0 for 2 thus far. This one doesn't look good so far. Down by a boatload as we enter the middle innings. It's about time they get something going. And the last thing you want to do is fall behind where you have to score a bunch in the eighth and ninth inning. Good fastball as he gets the swing and a miss. Into right field. That's a base hit. Stepping in now, Joe Cronin. On the ground to second base. This could be two. There's one. On to first, a double play. Next will be the designated hitter, Alexi Castillo. Two out, nobody on. Hit sharply on the ground. And that's through for his first base hit in this one. Into the box now, Drew Maggi. And a 2-1 slider is looked at for a called strike two. The 
slider freezes him at the plate. A called third strike, and the inning comes to a close. All set for the start of the inning, and next to bat will be the outfielder, Brendan Sanger. The 1 1 home is taken for ball two. That's bounced foul. It's two and two. Here it comes. On a swing, and he popped him up. Off to the left in foul territory. And there's out number one. Now with the plate, Albert Rodriguez. Albert Rodriguez. And he jumps at a changeup, a swing and a miss. High in the air out towards shallow right. Cabbage will drift over to his left a few steps as he takes it for the second out. The first baseman. Ready for another chance? Chris Rick. Rogers. He got Rogers. called out on strikes his last time through. Yeah, in today's game, certainly don't get completely reprimanded for too many strikeouts, but no one likes to go down looking. Expect him to be a little bit more aggressive at the dish this A.B. Here's a big swing and a miss on the fastball. Two and two. Taken high and deep to right. Racing back the right fielder at the track. And it's gone as they add still another. Second home run of the game right there. He is locked in at the plate. You hear so many of today's players talk about rhythm and timing. Well, he is perfectly on time in the heart of the zone. And now, Jose Rojas. And this ball runs away for ball two. Two and one. Hard hit ball to short. Reined in. Throw in time, and the side is retired. Jeremy Rose enters to do the pitching in the bottom of the sixth. Number 40, Jeremy. Bottom of the sixth inning now, and standing in the outfielder, Trey Cabbage. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. And he popped him up over toward the left side of the infield. And there's your first out of the inning. So striding in, Jose Miranda. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at bat with another big hit right here. The one and two pitch. And a fastball swung on and missed as he just reared back there, two away. Now at the plate, Ben Rortvet. He was a ground out victim last time up. Here it comes on one and one. Got him swinging, and that will end the inning. Randy LeBlanc comes on to pitch now, hoping for better results than the other arms that they've run out there in this one. Stepping in and ready for another shot, Zane Gerwitz. So far, two for three in this one. The 2-2. Two -two. And the throw to first is in time, so the leadoff man is gone here to start inning number seven. Stepping into the box, Roberto Baldochin. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. And that misses two and one. Hit out towards second. Oh, he makes the stop. He gathers the throw. Hey, now. Now to the plate, Jordan Zimmerman. He was sat down on strikes in his last at bat. Bases are empty here with two men out. He got him. Lively fastball that time, and it puts an end to the inning. Correct. 
digging in and looking for more. Akil Badu. And he's looking to add on to his two RBI game from earlier. It doesn't look very promising so far in this one as we move into the later innings. Down by a bundle, it's time to get some base runners and hopefully a long ball to get them back into this one. Now a changeup locks him up as he looks at strike three called, one away. So digging in now, Mark Contreras. He doubled earlier in the game, one for two to this point. And this ball is popped up, drifting back behind the mound. And there's out number two. So the lineup flips over and digging in, Todd McCain. He singled his last time up. Into the windup, here's the two and one pitch. Hit on the ground to short. And that will conclude matters here in the seventh. Andrew Vasquez enters now in a mop up role as he'll try to keep the deficit right where it is. Number 50 coming to the plate now, Julian Leon. He's two for three thus far. And a good take there will nut him a base runner as it's ball four now to start the eighth inning. Now, batting. now back to the top of the lineup, stepping in, Brendan Lund, who comes into this appearance in the midst of a one for four day. Full count now, three and two. With this one almost in books, the story was clearly the long ball. What are your thoughts on this offense, fellas? Well, Matty V, I don't know what your thoughts are, D-Roll, but boy, when the weather starts to warm up and the ball starts jumping out like this, it's clear that the pitchers need to start making better pitches. Yeah, just great approach. No one really chased today. Really stayed staunch on, on their ability to get that pitcher to come into the heart of the plate, and they did damage with it. Well above the letters with the fastball that time. Albert Rodriguez would be next. Hit hard down the left field line. But this is foul near the seats. Now the three and two pitch. Hit to short. Throw to first in plenty of time and the side is retired. Standing in, Joe Cronin. He was a double play victim last time around. Yeah, rolling into a two ball will eat at you for the rest of the game at least. So you know he wants to make up for it right here. And here's a fastball not close as he runs it to two and one now. Just behind the fastball there, two strikes now. Line to the right side, but a foul ball. Here now the 2-2. Is a swing and a miss. That's strike three. To the plate now is the designated now, hitter, the Alexi Castillo. And the pitch. One out, nobody on. Late making contact on that swing, and we'll do it again on one and two. Here it comes. Line hard to the left side. But this is a foul ball. Look out. Oh. That one almost got away from him. Two and two now. Yanked high and deep down the line in right. And it's a foul ball. The two two one more time. A bouncer up the middle. And that'll get on through into center, and he's got himself a one-out hit. At the plate now, Drew Maggi. A ball and two strikes. Pulled high in the air out to left field. Rojas is there to put it away, and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. Into the box now, Trey Cabbage. A hit in two at bats for him at this point in the ballgame. Cabbage! 
He's ready. Now the payoff pitch. Strike three called, and the inning is over. Joey Crable comes on to pitch now, hoping for better results than the other arms that they've run out there in this one. Set to start the ninth in this one, and set to go as the third baseman, Albert Rodriguez. Skied into straightaway right. Cabbage moves to his right and puts this one away in the alley for at number one. The first piece Next will be the cleanup hitter, Chris Rick. Rogers. Already Rogers. a pair of long balls on his line in this one, so we'll see what else he has in store here. This guy's having a pretty good week so far in one game. His last at bat is second home run of the game. We'll see if they'll pitch him a little bit more carefully in this A.B. And he'll squeeze this one for the second out. Ready for another shot now, Jose Rojas. He homered earlier and is two for three to this point. The 2 2. Zane Gerwitz would be next if they can keep this inning alive. The 3 2 pitch. And it's fouled away. Hit hard on the ground at first. Scooped up. And he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over. Six foot four inch right hander comes in out of the bullpen to do the pitching. Stepping into the box, Jose Miranda. He's one for two in this one. A one one to third. He's got it. Throw on to first, and one third baseman grounds out to the other, one away. Standing in, Ben Wortbeck. He struck out swinging in his last trip to the plate. Now the one and one pitch. This is hit the other way out toward left field. Rojas is there, and folks are starting to head for the exits now. Two gone here in the ninth. Better fielder. At the plate, Akil Badu. He's working on a one for three thus far. Good pitch as this is swung on and missed. And now they're down to perhaps their final strike of the evening. That's just too much velocity upstairs to get. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. And that'll do it here as the ball game is over. Well, this game had its moments, but it got out of hand pretty quick. Always nice when you can coast to a six-run win. Save your closer for another day and let everyone in on the action. Well, the man you see right there had a game to be proud of. He really came through and it mattered, and he's our top player of the game. Well, he blasted a couple of balls over the wall in this one, really put the guys on his back, and carried him to the victory.
eight to two tonight's final. Rocket City have evened up this series in one game apiece. Michael Santos takes home the win. Joe Anduran allowed seven earned runs to cross the plate in the losing effort. So that's a wrap for us here tonight. For my partners in the booth, Mark DeRosa and Dan Plezak, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. And for more, click over to theshownation.com. The final line score for our ball game for the victorious Crash Pandas, eight runs on 11 hits. No errors. They left seven men on base. For the Blue Wahoos, two runs, seven hits, one error. They left six men on base. Time of the ball game, three hours and 17 minutes.